Bruce? I said, give me a second. Uh, I will declare a quorum. We're all here. And Eric, Eric is back now. on remote. Can you take a minute? Chair will entertain a motion to approve the consent agenda, which improve, which includes the agenda for tonight's meeting, March 27th, and also the minutes from our last meeting, February 28th. Make a motion. Move. Second. Motion by Moore, second by Saylor. Any discussion? Hearing no request to speak. All those in favor, signify by saying aye. 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 Opposed? That motion carries unanimously. Uh, Madam President, anybody out there? And nope, I just got Ben and Eric on. Okay, well, Ben's going to be coming up here shortly. Uh, I do have some comments, finally, on the uh, last meeting of this uh, firm of the Village Board of the Village Board Edwards. I just wanted to thank you, Eric and Jen, for uh, making it a good year. And um, it's always fun to... Eric, you and I have been around the block together quite a few times, and Jen, uh, you had a very good year, and uh, uh, hope you hang around for quite some time. So, and also, when we get down to item number 14, I'll let you know without objection now we will not go there, because the next meeting of the Park and Recreation Cemetery Committee will be set on April 16th, which is a reorganizational meeting. And that's the night that the uh, president will uh, indicate the new committees and appoint the new chairs. So that's we'll have to wait till then. That was a blast. It was a lot of fun. So thank you again. Uh, ben, you still out there? Yes, sir. I hear you. You hear me? You got, I got you. Yep. I'm going to now, without objection, take item seven, your public, your monthly report, item eight, the update on the camera installations in the park, and item nine, summer calendar update, all at once. So once you start, you got to keep her going. Sounds good. Again, uh, thank you to uh, Mr. Zerflu and Jen and Eric and Betsy for being on this committee. It's been a, been a good year. A lot of good things I've got accomplished, and we set a good uh, foundation move forward for this Parks and Rec uh, group moving forward. We've got a su good summer calendar and other things that will keep good activities in the village moving forward. So thanks again to all you guys for your help. Great pleasure to work with you, and hopefully I see you again after April. Um, so the report, not a lot new going on in the parks. Uh, we start a little summer, spring cleanup with the Easter egg hunts coming before the snowfall the other day. Um, but obviously, we'll keep moving forward at the baseball and softball fields at Ripple Creek have been um, bases are on. They've been practicing on them. Restrooms at all the parks are open and um, our parks are essentially open for the summer as of as of now, unless we see some big change in weather, which I hope we don't see. Um, that goes with the dog park. The dog park is I think there's a new committee there and I've been in contact with them and we're already working on um, summer um, chores and lists and how we're going to work together and make sure we keep that thing clean and organized going through the summer. So um, that's moving forward on that. Um, the cameras last week, we started putting insula insulation or installing the cameras last week. They're going to finish those up hopefully early this week. And then next week, uh, uh, Chief Drew and his officers and myself and Mark will go down to each park and learn how to um, operate and make sure any issues we see so that they're up in full running. Um, obviously any concerns or issues we have in the parks will get transferred right to Officer Drew. Uh, Public Works Committee will not, crew will not be watching videos, anything like that. If they see a damage, they report it to Officer Drew. Officer Drew will go down there and watch the videos and move it from uh, his standpoint, what he wants to do after that. Just so I don't want anybody thinking the Public Works guys are down there watching videos. That'll get transferred right to um, the police department. Um, Good so um, as in uh, summer calendar, I believe was that attached to your guys's packet? No, nope. not if not, no big deal. But obviously, um, the garage sale is coming up in May, um, and then we have our first music in the park set up um, with the yellow pallets and the catering coming out of calendar uh, chatterbox like we did last year. Um, so as for the garage sale, um, we'll do our usual. I don't know. I'll work with 
Betsy, if we want to, you know, in the past, we let people call down the village office and set up a map. I can work with that. I guess it depends how deep we want to get, get into that, what the village's commitment to that event is. Obviously, we're putting on a one day. We'll work with Goodwill to make sure it's a Goodwill trailer at the village hall, like always, on Saturday afternoon. Um, but again, I guess at how much um, advertising we want to do, I guess that'll be up to the next parks committee, what we want to do, parks and rec, how much we want to get involved in that. I think in the past, um, administrator set up some kind of um, map of the village and you're able to post on that so we could show the different sites of um, the garage sales. But other than that, um, unless you guys have any questions, the parks, like I said, we'll keep cleaning them up and getting them ready for the spring spring and no big issues I see concerns moving forward in the summer. Is that it, Ben? That's all I have. Any questions for Ben? No. Nope. Okay, uh, without objection, I'm gonna insert something. Uh, Juris, would you like anything else to, uh, like the tree planting? Uh, would, would go through this committee with Ben, you know, that type of thing? Well, I, I've talked to Ben and Ben said that he's cut down some some ash trees or some other trees that were in poor health out of the park. So um, as far as that grant money, we're, we'll be uh, replacing trees and and uh, putting in uh, some new ones. One thing I do want to refresh yourself is that in 2020, well, that in 19, we had that big windstorm that mm -hmm. came through. Mm -hmm. So in 2020, we basically replanted about 79 trees. We had grant money from uh, stayed on that and we did plant uh, 18 trees in ripple and in the ballparks uh, back in that year so um we have put in some new seedlings there and they seem to be doing well good um the politician in me is coming out now if you want a good photo op for uh, uh planting a tree especially with the children from uh, the uh, school system uh, you can't beat downtown also gives our business a little yeah. oh downtown yeah okay so and then there are any if it, it's something like that is there a spot downtown that we could plant a tree for that arbor day or would you prefer just to go elsewhere yeah we got some room where that um fire um on the side of the building on four on uh, third street there we do have some open area i'd like to plant a couple of trees if we could um to keep that area you know, eventually want to get some park benches in there and try to make that little uh, friendlier area over there. So that would definitely be a good spot for a tree. Okay. We can rename it Joe's Political Garden then after I retire. All right. Thanks, Juris. But Mr. Hess, would you like to speak on any of them? No, thank you. Okay. All righty. Eric, anything? Nope. I'm good. Jim? All righty. Anybody have any old business? New business? I have received no correspondence. Betsy, have you? Nope. Uh, the item 13 and item 14. Uh, well, item 13, uh, are there any agenda items that we should pass on to? I don't have any. Maybe just a. The only thing we'll have would be the garage sale, but we'll just put that in my report for the next meeting and see what we want to do. All right, okay. and then maybe an update on uh, um, well, Arbor Day will be gone before probably they meet for their main meeting. Maybe. Yeah. Jersey, you think of anything that should be brought up again? I do not. Okay. All righty. Eric, anything? I don't have anything, no. All okay. right. Okay, uh, once again, before I declare the meeting adjourned without objection at 4.11 p.m., uh, it was a blast, it was a lot of fun, and um, let's hope that the uh, next board year and committees uh, goes like public works and this committee have had. Uh, we need camaraderie again, and so make her happen. So I will declare the meeting adjourned at 4.11 p.m. Thank you very much.